reading this book, I was students and staff. This particular song that I'm going to teach you today is inspired by all the weddings that were canceled this summer. So I was thinking that since all the weddings were canceled this fall and this spring, we might have double the weddings because many people had to hold off their weddings. So we're going to do some movement to uh, the very famous wedding march by Mendelssohn. Before we get started, I'm going to teach you three steps. Step one, I'm going to go like this. I'm going to transfer very dramatically. Now, if you have a ball, and if you're doing this at home, you get to, for step two, you get to bounce, catch, bounce, catch, bounce, catch, bounce, catch, and you're going to keep that in a steady beat. If you do not have a ball and you're at school, you can grab a piece of paper, crunch it up, and instead of down and catch, you can go toss and catch, toss and catch, since the, the ball of paper will not bounce. Then part three, it's pretty easy. It goes tap, tap, glitter, and make it a little dramatic because this is wedding march after all. All right, if you get this right, and if you practice so well, maybe you'll be featured in a future wedding. You never know, but make sure that you do not drop the ball. Try your best because if you drop the ball in someone's wedding, then the wedding cake is flying everywhere. Then the flowers are everywhere. It's going to be a big mess. All right. I'm going to step outside to play the music and you get ready. Again, down, catch, down, catch, down, catch, down, catch, down, catch, down, catch, down, catch. Tap, 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 glitter, tap, tap, glitter. Down, catch, down, catch, catch, down, catch, down, catch, down, catch, down, catch. Yeah, then we'll make it dramatic and we're going to free. All right, you have a lot of practicing to do. Make sure if you're planning to do on some, this on someone's wedding, did you practice real well? Have a good day.